Morning, good afternoon, good evening. BTC Simmer here. Today we're in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 at Inverness Airport. We're flying down to Dundee with our beautiful DA62. Alright, time is of the essence. So let's get her going. We have three passengers in. Um, the Fasconomy, sorry guys, F Fasconomy, and uh, we got Scotland Centre on, so it should be a good entertaining flight. Our route is uh, IFR, it's up to 8,000, it's uh, Davot N560 and Gussie should get us there. We're looking at runway 09 for landing down there, and uh, 05 take off here so let's adjust my rudder pedals here all right guys so we know the drill in this airplane alternators make sure they're on there they are master strobe nav check our parking brake which we should have done first off and on fuel selectors on trim set double check the trim again Fire up our avionics here. Tune uh, Scotland Center here. See if I can remember how to. Uh, three five five two five. Oop. Eight thousand feet. 5,000 feet, shortly, thank you. Golf Mike Alpha, Bravo Bravo 1, line up and wait for runway 06. Bravo Bravo 1, line up and wait for runway 06, Golf Mike Alpha. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, continue unicom Mike. Pioneer 22 Kilo Papa, about to close, Unicom and thank you for the service. Bye bye. Speedbird TTA. Speedbird 1438, report your passing altitude. Climb now, flight level 330. Passing 2200 feet, uh, climb flight level 330, Speedbird 1438. Shuttle Nana Victor, hello. It's, uh, um, with you at uh, flight level 380 in Bampol Hill. Shuttle 9 Victor, Scottish Control, good afternoon. MPIP 1 Echo Arrival. Uh, Shuttle 9 Victor, say again. Shuttle 9 Victor, is the MPIP 1 Echo Arrival. I acknowledge the MPIP 1 Echo Arrival, uh, Shuttle 9 Victor, thanks. Golf uh, Mike Alpha, surface one zero five zero degrees one zero knots, left hand circuits, Romy zero six, clear takeoff. Zero six cleared for takeoff with a left hand turnout for uh, circuits as a well. Golf Mike Alpha, thank you very much. Shuttle eight Yankee descent to altitude four thousand feet, turn right heading zero two zero degrees. Zero two zero degrees, four thousand feet, shuttle at Yankee. Eighty five zero two at direct Dean Cross, Delta Charlie Sierra. Uh say again, eighty five zero two. Eighty five zero two at direct Dean Cross, Delta Charlie Sierra. Uh would you be able to text me the clearance, uh eighty five zero two? Yankee descent to altitude 3,000 feet on the heading, clear by left approach from way uh, 06. Shuttle Yankee 3,000 feet, clear by LS on 06. And 
for the Yankee traffic for you. It's uh, Diamond 68. He's in the circuit's left hand uh, circuit's to the north, not above 2,000 feet. Copied. Shirley Yankee, continued approach on Unicom 122 decimal 8. Bye bye. 122 decimal 8. Thank you, Shirley Yankee. Golf Mike Alpha, traffic for you is uh, Airbus 319. He's about to establish 06, 14 miles. Golf Mike Alpha, looking. Golf Mike Alpha, I'm about to close. Continue the circuits on Unicom 122 decimal 8. Bye bye. Thanks for the great service. Uh, see you later, Golf Mike Alpha. ED502, continue Unicom 122 decimal 8. You can expect London North on 133 decimal 7 at Dean Cross. Uh, continue monitoring 122.8 Unicom, expect London Control 1337. Uh, easy 5 2 thank you so much for the help. Speaker 1438, same for yourself, you can expect London North on 133.7 at uh, Dean Cross. In the meantime, continue Unicom 122.8, bye bye. Roger, expect uh, London North on 133. Hey guys, he's closing, so. Monitor 122.8, thank you. Speedbird 1438. Shuttle 9 Victor. Anyway, yeah, he's closing, so I'm going to fire up here and. Um, there, avionics is off. Fire up here and uh, see if he's still on, then report IFR. If not, then we'll unicom it out. Alright. Let's go left engine. Let the glow warm up. Left prop clear. Gauges here. Oil pressure number one, make sure that starts right away. And looking good, I'll go to number two. And one off there, prop clear and fire it up. And again, most important, and along with the other ones. Okay, looking good. Maybe you want to go back on. Taxi lights on. Check our flaps. They appear to be going down. We're going to use runway 5, so we'll taxi Echo Alpha on runway 5. Let's see if he's still on here. Nah, he's gone. Inverness Traffic, Charlie, Juliet, Sarah, Victor, Romeo, type Diamond Twin, taxiing to runway 05 via Echo Alpha. Uh, departure to the south. Inverness. Alright. Go right here. <coughs> Try not to hit that pole. I remember one video I hit something. The plane didn't crash. <laughs> We got our taxi lights on, looking good. Not going to turn our pedal on because it's malfunction. Haven't played this in a while. Um, been doing the My Summer Car series. It's been coming along quite well. However, it's nice to switch back and forth to uh, Flight Sim. I've always played Flight Simulator, so it's one I'll be sticking with here on the channel, guys. However, I like to venture into different games. Another one I want to try is that Mon Bazo. I watched a video of it last night. It's a Canadian made game, so. Check that one out after the My Summer Car series is finished. Okay, we'll do our quick check here. Gas looking good. Undercarriage is down. Fuel pumps can go on. Takeoff flaps. Landing lights. Pedo heat. I think that's it for switches. Inverness traffic, Charlie Victor Romeo taking off runway 05. Inverness. Alright, let's get on out there.
check and make sure I'm recording. Yes, I am. All right, we said we're taking off, so we got to get going. Airspeed's alive, gauge is alive, looking for about 80 knots. Rotation speed. There we go. Nice takeoff into the wind there. See the wind gauge on the PFD. Got a positive rate. Gear can go up. There we got enough airspeed we can bring the flaps up. Hey, looking good so far. 600 feet. To the south, that's to the north. A thousand feet will make our turn onto course. Here is traffic. Charlie, Juliet, Sierra, Victor, Romeo. Uh, making a right turn on the course. Good day, Inverness. The rest of our switches check. Pumps can go off. Landing lights can go off. Flaps are up. Pedo is on. Probably 3x some of the crews, guys. Beautiful Inverness Airport down there. Sure do miss flying the 62, I tell you. Very fun plane to fly. Chop the power back a little bit here. Such an easy plane to fly too, I mean. Especially with FADEC. Not only because of FADEC, I mean, you got these great big screens in front of you. Give you everything you need to know. And it's very well balanced. It's, you know, doesn't take much to fly this one. That's too bad he went off there. I'd Check that's in view earlier, maybe quarter after. Hey, Scotland Center's on, right on. And sure enough, but that happens, you know. Like I said, these guys do a lot of work. They do it all out of their own time. So, I applaud them. It's rolling up to, what, 8,000? Transition at 7,000 over to uh, standard. Well, it's definitely IFR conditions here. I'll do a video one time of the tutorial flights, maybe. Get into that, that'd be fun. Got some rain up here. I wonder if we can get some icing. Did not check sky vector, so it's a possibility. Here is your eyes in this kind of weather. These are your eyes. One of my videos has 94 views. It's the Scone, Dundee, Aberdeen. Three flights I did in one there. So that's pretty cool. Still looking for 10 subscribers, guys. Tell your friends. Let them know. Want to start dropping some sats? Lightning, Bitcoin. It's ready and it's waiting. So, like, subscribe, and... Uh, 
You can get an airdrop of that from me. <laughs> but I need those 10 subscribers. And also, after I get 10, I'll give you guys a, tu a little tour of my sim pit, where I do all my flight sim, where I do all my simming. Do all my Steam games. So that'd be neat. There's our 1,000 foot warning, we're at 7,000, we'll transition now to standard. Well, we are standard, 10, 13. <laughs> hmm. I don't know what I was thinking, but... I think, well, why doesn't he fly to the southeast? Well, this is our route. So we've got to follow the route. 77... I'll let her settle down here a little bit. I am fighting a stick, so... You guys see the Top Gun add-on? Heard the movie was good from a few people. But haven't seen it myself. And <laughs> don't really plan on it. Go to a movie these days is a... Uh, arm and a leg. <laughs> now you get her trimmed up here and we'll go ahead and... Put on the auto. <clears throat> Charlie will direct us straight on course here. The foot of the mountains here. The Grampians, the Carrington range, I think. You guys got some nice mountains out here in Scotland. The temperature is that's six minus six. Okay. One mile from Davot, and then continue on to Gussie, I believe. It's our next waypoint. See what the weather's like down there. It's, it says it was raining, and uh, still VFR though down in. Uh, Dundee, so see what's going on there. Whoops. Let's have a check here. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I got a phone mounted on my yoke, the car mount, so serves as a nice tool in flight sim. I got Metar Taft downloaded on it, and I got uh, all the charts for all these airports I fly to over here through chartfox.org and just pull them up whenever and it's very very handy so what's the weather saying there at uh, 10 degrees and light showers 1500 foot few scattered 3000 oh, we could probably do a visual of 09 looks like the winds favoring 09 right now it's uh, 7 to 18 knots at 160 so that would be favoring 09 Okay, once we hit this gussy waypoint here, goosey or whatever you want to call it, then I'll 3x. I didn't know these are so close. That's alright. I do like how this plane draws out of both tanks. The 40 it draws out of one, you get a transfer. Or am I doing something wrong? <laughs> okay, let's set our. One oh eight point one for Dundee. There's our waypoint there, 108.1. That won't pick nothing up. And you guys know what I forgot to do? What I forgot to set when we were on the ground at Inverness? 
<laughs> Turn on the transponder. See what happens when you don't fly for a while. You forget these things. Bet London North is busy right now. Okay, so now we're 56, so we'll do a 2x here. 1, 2. Become a passenger here in the plane. Enjoying the view. <laughs> view to the west. Well, southwest, I guess it would be. Right over the mountains now. Of course, big cloud cover. <laughs> Watch those engines don't start picking up ice. Didn't check the icing report. Probably another thing I should have checked, but. But hey, what's gonna happen? We'll be fine, eh? <laughs> Famous last words. More 38 miles. <laughs> 22 8. Make sure we're still on there. Zero nine, probably do a straight in. Nothing too fancy. It shouldn't be too busy there, so. Okay, slow it back down here. One, two, right. We'll set our altitude here. Get down to about four thousand right now. Flight level change. Quick check here. Throttles, gauges. Gust check. Gas looks good. Undercarriage is up. Switches. Flaps are up. They're all the where they need to be. We're descending down to 4,000. Through transition through seven or Q and H we one zero one one. Probably called Dundee now. Dundee traffic, Charlie Juliet, Sierra Victor Romeo, type diamond twin is twenty one miles northwest, seven thousand three hundred, down to four thousand, inbound runway zero nine, uh, visual. Dundee traffic. Okay, you got an idea of where we are? So one zero one one. And there it is. And we've intercepted nineteen point nine for Dundee there. 108. 
1081 is our frequency there. IDDE channel 18X. That's an Orbex airport, I believe. Dundee, yeah. It's done pretty well, too. I did a tour of it many videos ago. Have a look if you want. I've done a few tours of airports around here. I did uh, Inverness, I did Edinburgh. Edinburgh was aftermarket as well. I can't remember the scenery creator. I bought it off the marketplace though. I did Oban, that was made by Scott Flight, I believe, through flightsim.to. Very good freeware scenery there. EGEO, Oban Airport. Um, no, I've done more. Can't recall right now. Oh, I've did uh, Aberdeen. Aberdeen's uh, I think the guy's name is Josh. He's also on flightsim.to. He just did the markings there in the parking spots at Aberdeen. He didn't do any scenery, I don't think. But did a really good job with that. And then uh, Sumbro as well. That's Orvix. Once in a while we'll head up that way, but I did that one as well. So that was my first ever tour. So. Okay, 4,000 in our scope. How about we go down to three? So 14 miles, uh, probably get down to two actually. 14 miles, so where's this gonna put us right, right at the foot of 09? So we'll probably turn off somewhere here, set our CDI and uh, Continue on. Cloud cover is not too, too bad, so. Just offset our heading here so we can turn to this heading. Go ahead and set our CDI to the runway heading. And then get straight on aligned. Probably a southerly heading here. That should work. And we'll do that at about 10 miles. We'll just go from uh, nav to heading hold. It's going to turn us. Place us uh, in line for 09. We can go ahead and do that now. The heading button here. CDI should be locked at 09 or 2, which would correspond to the correct runway heading. Here, looking good, looking good. Let's get a little more south there. 9.4 miles. Maybe we'll go. 2000, oops, the wrong button there, 2005. Ah, no, 2000 should be okay down here. It's a nice thing about flying over here in Scotland, all your elevations are <laughs> nearly zero or 100 or 200, no more than that though. You fly over in North America, your airports are all over the place. I mean, unless you fly to, obviously, the mountain airports, you're going to run into a few different ones. But Okay, now we'll go ahead and adjust our heading again to altitude as well. Put it down to 15. Adjust our heading to line up with localizer there. Make a nice, easy turn. Looking pretty low out there. We should do a check here. Let's do a gust. Gas looks good. Undercarriage. Seven miles. We're going too fast for that, so turn on the fuel pumps. Turn the landing lights. Pedo's on. Okay, 
1500 is looking awfully low here. It's okay, that's as low as we're going. Dundee over there off to the left, you can see it with the POI indicator. Little cheater hack, if you want to call it that. We'll just let off the throttle here. And get down into gear dropping range. I guess we could drop it now. You can do it up to 160, I think, on the 62. But... Grange. Grange? Grange. Grange. There's Dundee over there. You can see the airstrip there. We go ahead and drop the drop the gear. Switch our heading here, and we'll get right on line. We're a little late. That's okay. Gas is good. Undercarriage is down. Pumps are on. Landing lights are on. Roll one set of flaps. Dundee there. Turn off the autopilot. We got this. Hand stick it in here. Dundee traffic, Charlie Victor Romeo is 4.4 miles. Runway 09 final. Dundee traffic. Uh, 09 final visual Dundee traffic. Drop that speed a bit. Bear with me, guys. It's been a while since I've been in there. <laughs> Full flaps here. There we go, looking good. Keep it about above 85. Not much more than 90 though. <laughs> See the lights down there, we got three red I believe. It's sticking on here, I don't know why. There it is. Invergo, Invergo Ray? Wow. Invergo Ray. There's a glide ball there on the right, PDF by the altitude. We're a little high. Let it naturally come down. Too white, too red. Pappy's indicating different than her glide ball. Oh, no, no, it's high. Yeah, this is one of my most fun airports to fly in, that's for sure. Sunday traffic, uh, Charlie Victor Romeo's one and a half mile final, runway zero nine. Dundee traffic. 500, do a gust check again, gas looks good. Undercarriage is down. Pumps are on, flaps are set, and lights are on. Okay, getting a little low here, guys. Let's pitch that nose up. Probably won't be the most beautiful landing, it's been a few days. Wonderful city here, eh? Speed's looking good, a little high. It's too white, too red, right on. There are very light winds, which is which is good here. Zero nine. We came in a bit fast. That's okay. Drop the power. There we go. Flaps can come up. Pumps can go off. Pedo can go off. Okay, tap the brakes there again. And get off on this taxiway here. on our taxi lights, landing lights are off. 
This one is Taxiway Bravo. Just call and clear. Dundee traffic. Uh, Charlie Victor Romeo is clear of the act of taxiing Charlie Bravo Alpha to the main apron. Dundee traffic. All right. Newport on pay. What'd you guys think of that flight? Wasn't too bad. Nice little flight to come back to. I like to fly every two days and three days. I think the last thing I did was some circuits at Inverness. If I'm not flying a flight, I like to go up and do a couple circuits anyways. Get a video out there. I like to I like to push a video at least every day. Maybe take a day off here and there, but uh, nearly every day. Now he's right in my spot. Guess we can go park over here, eh? Shouldn't bother nobody. Oops. Straighten that wing out a little bit. That's good enough for me. Okay, we'll go ahead and set the parking brake. Alright guys, like, subscribe, stay tuned for more. You know me, I push a video out all the time. Might even sneak in a little summer car here today yet. Maybe, maybe not, not sure. Anyways, we'll shut this baby down. Taxi's off, strobe's off, avionics off. All electricals off. Right engine off. Which gauge is down to zero. Left engine. There's my menu. There we go. Nav off. Our position. Battery. Alternators. Okay, so that was Inverness to Dundee. There are three FSCE passengers. We had a touch of air traffic, but nothing like I thought we'd get, but that's okay. Hop out here. Isn't that a beautiful livery, this one. It, it grew on me. At first, I wasn't too crazy about it, but definitely grew on me. Alright, this is Dundee Airport. This is Orbeck Scenery, you guys. Got this off the marketplace. Alright, like, subscribe, and catch me on the next one. Everybody, have a great, wonderful day. I'll see you again.